So friends welcome back to code tonight in today's video we will see about an exception in c sharp asp.net and so the exception says object reference not set to an instance of object now you may get this error generally while working with various objects and various functions so this is a common error that we see uh, while development with asp.net okay so this error basically means that whatever operation you are trying to perform you are performing on the null value now how to actually capture this thing okay so first of all what you have to do is you have to place you have to place a debugger wherever you are getting this exception and what you have to do is you have to actually check if anything is there null and if you are performing any operation on the null value there so just in this example you will see that we have a loop here over a list and this list is here okay so now this list we can check that it is coming null now because we are trying to perform a operation on a null value that is why it is giving error object reference not set to an instance of an object so now how you can solve the error so it can be in different places okay so this is not that you are always using list and getting this error you can get this error generally in many cases so the way to fetch that out is you have to check that wherever it is getting error is you are doing something with any object that is coming null now whatever that object is you have to make sure that it doesn't come null in any case so for this scenario what we will do is we will assign new list or we can even assign some data to that list so we will just say double question mark and then we will assign a new list now what it means is that if employee list is null then it will pass a new list inside that and then it will not be considered as null and it will not give exception so whichever thing is giving error you have to make sure that it should not be null in any case because you cannot run operation on the null values okay so i have run the application and now we will see that if it still gives the error So here you can see that employee list is coming null and because we passed new list now so it is not null anymore and it is showing count zero. So now it is not null and that's why it will loop through that normally and it will not give any error. So this is how you can solve object reference not set to an instance error in ASP.NET MVC or any C sharp application. So thanks for watching guys and if you have any issue then you can comment on the video. Thanks for watching.